Hey there guys, this is I'm Real Ninja with Let's Play Bastion. Uh, in the last episode, we took down Point Lemain and got yet another shard. And at the moment, we're... I'd say about 66% of the way through the game. So, two-thirds of the way there. In this episode, we're going to start with Colford Cauldron. And see what lies ahead. Not everything blew up in the Calamity. Why Colford Cauldron here blew up way ahead of its time. It looks like we're gonna be coming back. The Cauldron boiled over some 300 years ago. Also yellow explosion. They say it filled the skies with ash and the lakes with molten rock. If you wanted to survive something like that, you had to learn to adapt. Best to keep out of the cauldron. Okay, that was kind of odd. So, in a way, the beasts of the wilds, they're all survivors, too. Why do I keep stepping off? This is, this is getting annoying. Already. It takes a certain stubborn pride to keep on living in a place like this. As for us, we learned an awful lot from Colford oh. Culver. That learning led to some interesting inventions. I completely forgot about this weapon. This is the greatest thing ever. The raw power of the world fell right into our hands. The game has a flamethrower. I have, in case you can tell, but I'm pretty sure I'm going to. Uh, but yeah. By far one of my favorite weapons in the game that is not the uh, pistols. You have Playing like with the cauldron's fire is it became an addiction. Now you can. people for their natural curiosity now, can you? Sure, we dusted off a good many secrets out here. But we discovered other things we're better off not knowing. The unforgiven scent of sulfur's dirt. Taste the air so hot it sticks to your lungs. Uh, that said, though, the flamethrower, fire bellows, whatever, is by far one of the best weapons in the game. All 
sorts of awful things crawling underfoot. For instance, uh, for that to close up, you can sit here and burn the plants while they're uh, Which is already insane. You can cook those things, but you can't eat them. So much life and all that ash. We kept on sifting through the cauldron secrets anyway. Inhospitable as they come. But still, we pressed on. After all, when we look down inside Colford Culture. Look down through all the smoke and flames. We saw in there the heart of the world. The heart now laid bare by the calamity. We had to have it. As for the kid, he just has to get that shard out of there. Too bad taking that thing woke up every last stink eye from here to Jocelyn Bog. Kid's thinking he's got to trek all the way back around the cauldron. Stink eyes ever seen waiting for him on the other side. Well, it ain't polite to stare. And where there's one stink eye, there's always more. The cauldron's tenants all gather up to bid the kid a fond farewell. Kid don't shed any tears for me. With a good spyglass, you can still see the cauldron from the city. But all the fires died out. There's nothing left of it. So, once again, got another shard in hand. He Making comes back looking like the inside of a chimney. <laughs> oh. that, uh, that's something else. I had already, already shown off what Zia has to say about the ceramic stockpot and sealed notes, so we'll just talk We're about We're all this. a little short on friends these days, so that's a welcome sight. Let's see. Have anything to say about it. They said the wild could never be tamed. If only they could see us now. I'm trying to remember. 
remember. Is that... The shard works like a charm. You can hear the monument's heartbeat again. There's an achievement for playing with all the animals. And I can't remember if it's... if I have enough yet or not. Because there's a... There's the bull. The ankle gator. The pecker. The squirt. I, I can't remember. I've already gotten the achievement. I got that in my first playthrough, so... Let's go ahead and let's upgrade the lost and found. We need an awful big lost and found under the circumstances. I see. Ooh. Uh, yes, please. And something pointy. That's brusher's pike, army carbine, dueling pistols. We still haven't found out what something burnt goes to. Uh, something foul is the fire bellows, and we don't know it's something wrong goes to. Let's see, bull brandy. Ooh. Ooh that sounds really good. Uh, leech aid. Leech aid is bad. Like, really bad. It's, uh... The culture. Yeah. A still life of old unwanted keepsakes. The, uh... All the various mementos. The pecker nest was the last one you needed for it. Uh, gather fragments. Harness the forge. Reach level five. Build the bastion. That's that's coming up. And overcome the trial of the gods. The trial of the gods will be a separate video. I think I've already mentioned this at this point. So let's real quick. Uh, Let's upgrade the... no, not the pike. Let's upgrade the carbine. That's the way Speed to make every shot and count. And Even the army speed. never issued carbines in such fine shape. And to fix a brusher's pike, you just need a good length of knife bark. Uh, Ain't never letting go of his old friend with a sturdy grip like that. We spotted a pecker carrying a shard to Mount Zan. Uh, let's uh, let's actually, I I want to show off the army carbine and the fire bellows, proving grounds before I end this episode. So let's let's go ahead and get that out of the way, because I didn't show off army carbine last episode. Ceylonia's army only took the best, and the best of them trained on Trigger Hill. The triggers I, believe they were nothing without their rifles. I have actually forgotten how this one goes. Nothing beats the feel of shooting a Ceylonian army carbine. Oh my god, I got so much better. Sometimes you had to take care of the steadier shot. Jeez. Oh, Triggers had clearance to modify their guns however they chose. Some felt the course was too easy, so the triggers spiced things up a bit. The kid ain't bad, but the triggers were better. <laughs> I, I've gotten somewhat decent at that. I was only off by five seconds. This might be the next one. Because I forgot. The moment you put, the moment you get aiming speed, the carbine. If you want to master so the art of the fire art, crap. then the place to go is Trigger Hill. That's not what I wanted to do. And I can't go back to the bastion yet. So another shot. Chances are, uh, I might just end up. What's called? Sometimes you had to shoot from the hip. They had to keep moving to avoid getting burned. Should this be an actual successful attempt, I'll just I'll keep it in with this video. And it will be. It blows oh my that gosh. Like it was nothing. 
Oh my gosh, how... how did I even... <laughs> I suck with that weapon, that's the thing, I never use it. The Ceylonian army would have recruited him in a flash. I never use that weapon because I'm so bad with it. The triggers, my brothers, bravest men I ever knew. Oh my god, that's insane. <laughs> I should not have been able to do that. Uh, fire bellows. Let's do this, and then call it an episode. Welcome to Grady Incinerator, home of the hottest wings east of Ceylonia. In all seriousness, the incinerator was a dump, and it had a problem with peckers. Blasted things would swoop in and spread trash all around, until we started using fire. We couldn't just torch them all at once. We had to use restraint. The Peckers were willing to fight tooth and nail for all that trash. City clean. We put all our trash in Grady Incinerator. I. Beggars that flock together were easy pickings. I think I. I don't, I don't even remember if I upgraded this. This is a bad thing. So, uh... You'd almost think those peckers like getting cooked. Let's, uh, let's real quick upgrade the fire bell I was calling an episode. Let's see, fuel generation, flame spread wider. At least it won't get cold around here with that thing around. Uh, and this, this is a tough one. More damage with each flame, which is insane. Considering how much damage it already deals. Or I could have it burn over time. On the inside, a fire bellows ain't nothing like its more popular air spitting cousin. Alright. So, with that, I uh, got yet another shard. We are down to two left. Oh. I even know Still I no mail. Go figure. <laughs> it's funny, because everyone's dead. But yes. <laughs> Uh, we only have two more things to upgrade, so two more shards to get. And then the Bastion will be fixed. So, until next time, this has been I'm Real Ninja with Let's Play Bastion. Take care, have fun.